All right, let's do a breakdown of the middle stance. This is our next beginner stance. So, middle stance. Yeah, another bit on the front stance video, we talked about there's three beginner stances. Front stance is meant to drive power forward. Middle stance is meant to base down. And then back stance is how to be strong in case you have to back up. So the three stances, what if you're moving forward, what if you're just dropping, what if you're moving back. So let's talk about a correct traditional middle stance. A correct middle stance is two times shoulder width apart. So correct middle stance is one, two, all right? Any wider, I'm losing balance, not gaining balance. So, one shoulder width, two shoulder width. Now the next thing is this. I've got to bend my knees and keep my back straight. Next thing is this. A penguin stance is very common. I want to put my body weight on the balls of my feet and I want to push my heels out. So they're going straight forward. Last piece. I don't want my knees bent in like this. I want my knees forced out. So four ingredients to a correct middle stance. Number one is shoulder width times two. Number two is knees bent. Number three is heels pushed out. Number four is knees forced out. That's my correct middle stance. Show you from the side. Here we go. And one, two. Knees bent, heels forced out, knees forced out. I'll keep my back straight, I won't bend my back. Back stays straight. So that's a breakdown of a traditional Taekwondo middle stance. Go practice.